Um, this is video log number three. I'm documenting how to log into my um, uh, freshly installed or freshly imaged Ubuntu server on Raspberry Pi 3 model B. Um, I think right when you log in, when it's done, you know, uh, booting up, you can SSH um, with a default username. I think it's Ubuntu. At uh, type in your um, uh, IP address. Uh, you can, if you don't know your IP address, without logging into it first, because I don't really want to log into my, for my purpose, I don't want to log into my Raspberry Pi. I just want to be able to um, SSH into it and do my work and 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 carry on from there. Okay, so um, there, and the default password for Ubuntu is actually Ubuntu. There, so I'm in, which is pretty great. Okay, it's giving me a couple of, uh, um, I think uh, I, I just initiated the login. I haven't logged in yet. Uh, great, this is good. I just want to quickly read through this. Uh, it's Ubuntu 18.04.4. Um, uh, it's long-term support, which is good. It's a stable version. Um, all right, so the, this is the, the reason why I installed Ubuntu. Um, I ended up going with Ubuntu is because um, uh, it's it's derived from Debian and it's you know concurrent with the commands that I'd be using. I think some of the Raspberry Pi users can um, uh, follow using um, when they when they've installed Raspbian, which is a port from Debian. Uh, so you know we've worked sort of different um, um, I wouldn't say different hierarchy but you know different lines but they all stem from Debian so the commands are going to be the same okay so uh, current password is Ubuntu great new password uh, I'm not gonna say it but I'll uh, type it in good now I will let's uh, log me out great which is good I need to type in my new password um, to log in Oop, I just messed it up all right good so I am in now um, so uh, okay so uh, who am I? I am definitely Ubuntu. See if I'm uh, uh, a sudo or sudo. Who am I? Who am I? I'm root. Okay, so I don't want to work as uh, Ubuntu for sure. Um, I'm going to work as Pi, which is pretty much the default username and password. Well, user account for most of the uh, uh, you know uh, Pi users. Raspberry Pi users. So I'll call it, uh, I'll say sudo add user pi. Okay. I'm going to enter my super secret password. Um, let me think about it. Okay, so full name is, I'm going to say Raspberry Pi. I'm going to leave this blank, 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 blank. Yes, it's correct. And I am, I am, um, I'm done. Now I'm going to log out. I'm going to try to log back in as Pi. All 
All right, so um, sorry about that. I forgot my password, which I just created a couple of seconds ago. I uh, remember it right now. Um, back on. All right, so um, again, just to recap, um, uh, this is a uh, uh, so now I created uh, a username called Pi, um, and I just want to make sure that uh, we are seeing that I'm still using a Raspberry Pi 3 and uh, this is Ubuntu server um, and I just wanted to have uh, you know because both Raspbian and Ubuntu they stem from uh, Debian the commands I'm going to be using are going to be the same okay cool so now that Pi is created uh, I want to know if um, Pi is one of the sudoers. So let's see um, how can we even test this out. Um, uh, one way is let's do groups pi. It's just pi uh, or sudo who am I? Okay, let's type in uh, the password. Uh, definitely not it. Yeah, so pi is not in the sudoers file. Okay, so this is pretty cool, uh, but we need to put them in the sudoers file. Um, so the way you do this is let's go now, let's log in as Ubuntu, which actually is a sudoer because I can't really add myself to a sudoer if I'm not a sudoer to begin with. Okay, so let's log in. Let's go back to my home. I think it's sudo uh, user mod add G sudo pi, right? All I have to do, all I have to do is add pi to the group sudo by using this user mod command, which has to be run as sudo. And it seems like uh, Ubuntu doesn't need a password. It's like without, you know, so got to be careful. You got to make sure that Ubuntu is pretty secure. The username Ubuntu should have a pretty like solid password, just so you know that. Okay, for security reasons. I'm going to now exit and type in groups uh, pi. Definitely belongs to the pseudo groups now, as you can see right here. Okay, um, so let's do pseudo who am I? All right, asking for a password. Ah, looks like I'm still not it. I think what you have to do is you just have to log in, log out, and log back in. So let's log out. And I'm gonna log back in. Okay. All right, well, now let's do sudo who am I. Type in your password for pi. You don't have a password for sudo. You're just going to type in your password of, password for pi. And there we go. So now pi is one of the sudoers. And um, you know, I just want to make sure that I don't have to log back into uh, Ubuntu to you know to be you know, to have sudo privileges. Okay. So this is cool. Um, this pretty much ends the video. Uh, I and also I told you guys why I'm using uh, Ubuntu as opposed to OpenSUSE. I just didn't like it at all, and plus it just it's going to be more more in line with you know the rest of the Debian community. Thanks.